Hi guys, Bob for Bob's Movie Review here, and today I'd like to review for you a movie I recently watched called Why Him? Now, was this as much of a letdown as Office Christmas Party? Well, I guess you'll have to stick around and find out. <laughs> uh, so a couple people had requested that I reviewed this one, so uh, I'm going to go ahead and do that. Now, this movie starts out with um, the daughter, can you remember her name now? <laughs> and uh, she... She is having a kind of like a FaceTime or a, uh, I was gonna say Snapchat, a uh, <laughs> whatever. They're they're doing like a face to face over the computer and whatnot. And um, her boyfriend James Franco walks in and starts taking his clothes off. So um, the family decides to come out to probably California, I believe, and meet him. And turns out he's like this millionaire software develop app developer i guess they were games and they find out their daughter's been kind of lying to them for months all these all these things that she's planning that they really don't know about and so james franco's character who plays her boyfriend is kind of like really trying to impress the family and he reveals to the dad brian cranston that he's gonna ask the daughter to marry him with his only with his blessing and so over the next few days, he's trying to impress the family and get in good and, and try to um, get his approval because he, he means it when he says he'll only do it with the dad's approval. Um, so I'm just going to kind of start with what I'm disappointed in with this movie. I really didn't find this movie to be very funny. Uh, there were a few, you know, kind of funny parts, but nothing like super funny, nothing that made me laugh really hard, and nothing that I, I didn't really find this movie to be super humorous. I mean, they get James Franco up there, and he's just like, F this, F that, you know, F everything. Like, I swear, it's every three to four words out of his mouth, you know, is the F word. And, you know, obviously, when you're trying to impress somebody's parents, you're not going to be talking like that. And it, it doesn't come off as funny. Like, I don't know why they think it's funny, but it really isn't, I don't think. Maybe you younger guys would think it's funny. Maybe I'm too old now, <laughs> you know, but... Uh, not that I like, I want to censor the movie or anything like that. I just, I just feel like they, they think him constantly swearing is a joke, but it's not funny. You know what I mean? So, <laughs> so, uh, I definitely didn't think this movie was very funny. Now, pardon my French, but I thought this movie was cute. It was a cute story. Um, it's actually a really good story. I really enjoyed the story. And I wonder if maybe this movie misses its key demographic with the the raunchy attempted humor uh and it's it's not even that raunchy i don't think it's it's mainly just james franco's constant swearing i guess really and just his vulgar mouth you know is is kind of really the only thing but it's it's kind of like this you know cute acceptance coming of age love story slash family drama <laughs> A Christmas movie, really. And, you know, I feel like maybe they could have hit a bigger demographic by making this uh, PG-13 instead of R. Um, but I, I did actually, in the end, I will say that I enjoyed this movie. I, I really liked the story. Um, I liked the characters. And um, it might be a little cliche for sure. But, you know, I, I thought it was a fun movie with, a, with a, a, a good story. Just, it wasn't very funny. And if, if you didn't tell me this was supposed to be a comedy, then I wouldn't have probably guessed it was supposed to be a comedy. Just because, I, I just, I really didn't think it was funny, guys. Um, but I did like it. I think it was a good movie, a good story. Uh, def definitely worth checking out. You know, if you got the youngsters, though, it might be a little hard to watch. Uh, you know, but, uh, yeah, I liked it, guys. What did, what did you guys think of it? Um, I'd love to hear you guys' thoughts in the comment section below. Uh, for a score on this one, I'm going to give it a 6 out of 10. You know, may maybe it would have got a little higher if I would have laughed a few times, you know, but, uh, yeah, I liked it, guys. So thanks for watching. If you guys enjoyed this review, be sure to give it a thumbs up. I appreciate it. it Help support the channel. And if you haven't already, subscribe for more videos. Check out the suggested videos and see you guys next time.